Hello and welcome back to another card opening video. I've got uh, three little boxes here of some stuff. I've got a 2022 Topps Chrome Platinum, 2023 Topps Chrome, and a 2023 Bowman Mega Box. Uh, these all are in different prices. These were 30, this was 35, and this I think was 45. Uh, at least that's their uh, marked price. And I just figured I'd open each of them and see, see which one is better. Uh, see how they all compare. I've opened all these before many times. I thought I had sworn off Topps Chrome, but I figured I'd give it one more shot. Topps Chrome Platinum slowly growing on me. And the Mega Boxes here are hit or miss. At least that's how they've been for me. Um, but Barnes and I actually bought all these at Barnes and Noble, and they had a 20% off sale this weekend. So I got all these for 20% off. So that definitely helped uh, cut the price down. I don't I don't even shop at Target or Walmart really anymore for for cards. Um, cause you, I can get all these at Barnes and Noble and I get 10% off regardless. And this weekend they just happened to be 20% off. So, and for some reason, Topps Chrome is more expensive at Walmart. This is $40 at Walmart, but it's 35 everywhere else. Um, I think ultimately the better box is going to be based on, um, if either one has an autograph, hopefully I'll get like one auto out of here. Three would be awesome. Uh, there's a possibility of getting four cause the mega box could have two, but I think I'll probably get one. I think, uh, probably the best box is going to be. I honestly think it's probably going to be the top score platinum because there's no guarantees of parallels in these. Um, and, there, and you get at least three here, and then you usually get about two uh, two colored cards. So this was the cheapest box. Um, so I'll start with that since it was thir you know, $30. So I'll pop into this one and see what I get. Yeah, so I was going to stop buying baseball cards for a little bit until at least the Chantilly show next month. But then I got an email that Barnes & Noble had their stuff at 20% off and I figured, hey, you know what? I'm losing money by not buying these, so I'm gonna give them a shot again. So, first box of Platinum Anniversary. Uh, nothing thick in here. Cal Marte, an upside down Bob Gibson. That, I think is a refractor. Yes, you can see it's got the word refractor right on top there. Uh, Ricky Henderson and Monte Irvin. I don't think I've ever heard of. Um, it's I've ripped quite a few of these blaster boxes. I've gotten a couple autographs, but I've never gotten a short print. I don't think, yeah, I don't think I've ever gotten a short print out of them. So, oh, uh oh, uh oh, Wanda Franco. That's weird. Two are straight, three are bowed, but. One. Oh, that one's backwards. That one's now. Remember when these when these first came out, the collation was everywhere. You had some cards face up, then behind it they were upside down, backwards. I think they finally got that taken care of, just in case it's something good. Uh, let me just put those to the back. Gary Sheffield. There's the kid, King of Free Junior, and a Robbie Ray is our first Prism Refractor. There's the one to Franco, and just in case this card is something special. Uh, it's not. It's just a base rookie of Jose Siri. Okay. All right. Nothing to see here. On to the next pack. Rodolfo Castro. Jose Miranda. Oliver Ortega. And Stuart Fairchild. So four rookie cards in a row right there. That's pretty nice. I don't think any of these, no, none of them were refractors. So that's always nice getting rookie cards, even if they're not anything special. Rookies are rookies. And this is a, another, huh, maybe this is an old supply. I don't, I don't know. Uh, hey, Mike Trout. Won't say no to a Mike Trout. Not a refractor. MJ Melendez. Herman Marquez and Salvador Perez. Now, Herman Marquez is right there. All right, still no uh, regular parallels. Only four packs left. I'm getting a little bit concerned. Again, the two parallels is not a guarantee, but that seems to be how the packs are working. Uh, Willie Adames, Wade Boggs, Alfonso Rivas, and Jim Tome. And again, after I open all these cards, I'll stop and look and see if... Uh, have any short prints or anything like that. All right, still nothing. Wow, this is gonna be a bust box. And 
Jackie Robinson, Hunter Renfro, and Marcus Semyon. No refractors there. Okay, two packs up. These should have our two prism refractors. Uh, you can get prism refractors. They're just added on this regular pack, so you can get a parallel and a prism refractor in one in one pack. Uh, unfortunately, not in this one. Edgar Renteria. Uh, Kyle Hendricks. I don't know what is going on with all these cards. Adrian Beltre. Alec Bump, and our blue prism is, ooh, okay. This has been a pretty nice box so far. Uh, it's a little off-centered, though. Uh, I know. Throw it away in the trash. It's off-centered. Garbage. That's still that's still nice. That's still a nice card. Uh, I guess that kind of makes up for probably not having, <laughs> are we going to have any colored inserts in here? It's our last pack. We're going to have a prism refractor, and we are going to have one parallel. Okay. Could be it could be an auto. Let's take a look. Nico Horner, Paul Goldschmidt, Prism Refractor. Okay. Brandon Belt, Joey Bart, and the last card of this box. Green. Maybe cool if it was an autograph. Looks like an old timey St. Louis. I think that's a dude. Ted Simmons. Ted Simmons numbered out of 299. Okay, uh, I'm sure the three people that watch this video are going to blast me in the comments and let me know that Ted Simmons is this awesome, amazing player. I have absolutely no idea who this is. I'm, I don't know this name. But uh, I'm a little sad that I only got one colored parallel, but I did get a nice blue J-Rod. So that's not bad. In fact, I actually opened a box a couple days ago and got a refractor J-Rod. So that worked out pretty well for me. All right, let's open up this... Tops Chrome. Again, I said I figured the uh, the Platinum was going to be the best box, but that was because I was expecting two parallels. Um, and I didn't get that, but that's all right. All right, that's empty. All right. So Tops Chrome has been kind of bad for me, to be honest. I haven't really gotten anything out of it other than, you know, the, the $20 MVP buybacks. I have got some really nice X-Fractors. Um, but those are out of the mega boxes. So Tyler O'Neill, Hugh Darvish, and Paul Goldschmidt parallel. There's still nothing. Um, I've yet to pull an autograph. I think I've done six mega boxes and like five blasters or so. Still have yet to get an autograph of any kind. Mookie Betts. Uh, could win MVP. Uh, it's not guaranteed that Acuna's going in. I think Acuna will, though. And, Sosa, and the pink is a Hunter Brown. Hey, rookie, rookie pink. This is a blaster exclusive. So, do need to hold on to those Mookie bets just in case. Because you never know. All right. A Miguel Vargas rookie. Cade Cavalli. Albert Pujols. And Salvador Perez. Got another... Pink one in here. You're gonna get some pink and some sepia. Uh, Garrett Mitchell rookie. Jordan Walker. Hey, that's not bad. Marcus Simeon. Gabriel Moreno. That's a refractor. And the pink is Jazz Chisholm. Jazz Chisholm. All right. Three packs left. Oh, this this one feels really. And this part doesn't have the other two have probably the sepia cards on the back. Ooh, this one I think has something. Oh, I think it's just an insert. Yeah, just an insert. Uh, that's the Adley Rushman fake out card. Oswaldo Cabrera, that's not bad. Hey, a Kodai Senga. And the insert is Giancarlo Stanton. This is just a prism refractor, it looks like. Okay. Maybe you don't get sepia in this box. I thought you did. Maybe it's just two prism refractors. Javier Assad, Reese Hoskins, Geron Encarnacion, and Oswaldo Parada parallel, and up, and a CP of Luis Robert. Okay. All right, last pack. Still haven't really gotten anything out of this box, but maybe this last pack has nothing. All right. Dansby Swanson, regular GM color stand, Michael Grove. Cal Stevenson, and the last card is going to be a CPA. Hey, a Bobby Witt Jr. Gold Cup. That's not horrible. 
not horrible at all. All right, but I think I made the right decision swearing off uh, any further boxes of Topps Chrome. That just wasn't very good. And now the most expensive box of the three. And this is going to come down to what's in those two mojo packs. I'm not really going to get anything out of these four base packs. Uh, so just a lot of nothing. I mean, maybe you can get a Drew Jones or something. Yep. I have so much of this. Can't get any parallels. So, Adley Rushman rookie. Robert Perez Jr. That guy. And that guy. All right. That's regular pack. Corbin Carroll, rookie. Let's go through the vets. Lazaro Montez. Christian Hernandez. Joshua Baez. Hey, Junior Caminero. Chrome, that's a nice one. And Max Wagner is actually pretty good, too. I'm going to put Lazaro Montez into the, into the decent stack as well. well. Let's get these all nice and ordered. Okay, two more base packs before we get into the mojo packs. Get through the vets. Masatika Yoshida, Groshans, Ricardo Perez first, Brock Jones. I think I got his autograph. Dion Jorge, Andres Meza, Meja, Meza, and Gabriel Gonzalez. All right, that brings us to the last regular pack. Mookie Betts, Kyle Stowers, there's an Acuna. Austin Charles, Axel Sanchez, Luciano, Yasser Mercedes, and Brooks Lee. All right. So this is now, these are going to be the big ones here. Let's see what we get. Nope. Don't want to see that card. But it looks like I ripped off the tab and didn't get it open. All right. We have something. No. No beef. That's a shame. All right. Moises Ballesteros. Jackson Holly's not bad. This could be an Ellie. It's not. It's uh, Rafael. I think he's currently playing at the moment in the bigs. Tristan Cassis. That's not bad. And hey, Shohei. And his season's officially ended. Shohei Otani. So, eh, not, not a horrible mojo pack there. All right. With my luck, there's probably not going to be any uh, any good cards in this mojo pack, but let's just open it and find out. All right, hey, there's a Lazaro, and nothing. Yep. All right. Bummer. Lazaro Montez. How you Lee. Garrett Mitchell. Trey Turner. And a Brett Batting. All right. So, not a horrible box opening. Wasn't very good, to be honest, but not horrible. Just run back through some of the good cards. Ted Simmons Green, Paul Goldschmidt. I think this is probably the best card of the, of the bunch. Uh, refractor, Mike Trout Base, Robbie Ray and Bob Gibson Refractor. Topps Chrome had the Hunter Brown Pink, Bobby Witt Jr. Sepia. Aldo Peraz, Robert, John Carlo, Jordan Walker, and Miguel Vargas, and then the 2023 Bowman, How You Lee, Lazaro Montez, Shohei Mojo, Lazaro Paper, Junior Caminero, and Max Chrome. So, yeah, I think I was right. It was the cheapest box that uh, that had the best. Uh, and if, man, if only I had gotten that second parallel out of it, that would have been pretty nice. Uh, so thanks again for watching. I'll have another video out soon. I've got some 2020. I got a 2023 Bowman Chrome Mega Box or not Mega Box, um, uh, Hobby Box coming. It's supposed to be delivered on Wednesday, so we'll see. In the meantime, uh, thanks for enjoying this video, and hope to see you guys again soon. Remember, you are loved.